Hello YouTube, this is Cheska from STEM APKs. Welcome to another tutorial. In this tutorial we're going to be talking about spatial filters and, and what, how we can use them to, um, to manipulate images. And this is a very good uh, website. Uh, I'm going to include it in the description of this video. So and it goes really into detail into the math behind the spatial filters and explains it. Uh, I we don't have time to go over these. I, you can spend a whole semester uh, talking about spatial filters and frequency filters. So, but this website does a very good job explaining uh, the different uh, mathematics behind it. Uh, we're going to be discussing uh, these three filters down here. I'm going to be discussing uh, the Sobel operators, the Gaussian. And the Laplace and 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 the difference on on how we can use them to our advantage. Okay, so let's get started. I wrote um, a couple programs here that um, we can more or less um, give us an idea of of, of how images uh, behave under each one of these filters. And let let's um, open one of them. The first one is. Uh, pseudo nano filters ui oops wrong one uh, control x out of here so, this, uh, what did i do oh i forgot the s pseudo nano filters py there it is and this is a, a, a little small code that explains uh, how the Sobel operator works. And uh, as you can see, I'm going to include this in the description of the video. So, um, uh, so let's save it. And uh, yes, let's run it. And it's going to take this uh, this image right here. And let me show it to you before. It's going to take this image right here, and uh, it's going to uh, it's it's a uh, it's a it's a nice beach. It's it's, it's one of the nicest beaches uh, I've seen. Um, but it's going to take this uh, this image right here, and it's going to apply the oil operator. Okay. So let's hit enter, and as you can see, it does a, a grayscale on it. Uh, let me, you see, it makes it a grayscale, and then once I close it, it applies the filtering process that was in, in, in the program, and after I close it, it creates an image, it saves an image right here. It's, it's being created right here. And we'll open it and you'll see it. And this is uh, after the Sobel operator has has been uh, applied. You can see the edges, you can see the the water where the the waves break here. You can see it right here. Um, you can see the rock, you can see this dark spot right here this dark spot right here this is where this dark spot right here okay and uh, you, this is the Sobel operator let's show you another one we're going this time we're going to so no uh, and this is this one uh, th this is a, it, it works a little bit different. It applies a, a different principle. Uh, it's going to blur the image and then it's going to subtract and, and it's going to show the, the result. Let me show you here. Control S. As you can see here, 
it's, it's a lot different from from the other one there's a, a lot more you see where the this part here where the where the where the waves break is a lot more defined here around the rock this section here around the rock as you can see here is a, a lot more defined um, the, the dark spot from the original here this origin this section right here this original black part you can see it here a, a lot more much better defined and it creates a folder uh, an image in the folder and you can see it here it's a little bit more uh, more detail than the, this the under this available area. one is not better than the other it just depends on, on which applications you you, know, you are using and now uh, and what you're doing it's not one is not better than the other um, some of them are computationally more expensive so it's it's, it's, uh, it's up to to you which one you you would use and the third one and final one that we're gonna see is the um, is this one right here it's, it's the Laplace the Laplace Laplace and let's run that one it's Python image and it's, it's saved it into the folder and you can see here um, where is it? It's just, there it is and look at the difference this is a lot so it's very different uh, you can see the the edges a lot more well defined here uh, you can see the colors it, it almost gives it a, a bluish color and you can see here the dark spot right here it's a lot uh, more defined and uh, the rock you can see the colors it's all the edges it's, uh, it's, it looks really nice and that's this is the end of this tutorial uh, like always uh, if you like this video please click the like box and subscribe and uh, we will see you in the next tutorial thank you have a great day